I don't like this kind of thing anymore. Do you do? By tomorrow morning, out. we'll have a dozen white parents down here yanking their kids out of school. Do you want us to lose our federal money? But nobody. We've was... got to get rid of troublemakers. No one was hurt. Now, you throw Watson out and you throw him on the garbage heap. Mr. Davis, we can't worry about every kid who refuses to fit in. But we'll only be passing the problem onto the streets. There's got to be a way to reach these kids. No one can. Then what are we here for? That's not what I meant. I mean, there are some kids who just can't be reached. And will you let me try and do something with this one? You know, if you fail, it's your responsibility, not mine. Let me try. Doing, JT? Doing good. Nice out here, isn't it? Yeah. That's what you came out here to tell me? Oh, no, I came out here because I wanted to get a suntan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me too. You're cool, man. Real cool. Thanks. You know, I mean it. Check your record. Lots of ability, lots of brain. That's cool. But throwing away a diploma just to blow black on some white kids, that's not so cool. All you want to do is protect them honkies. Man, you got honkies on the brain. Yeah, well, you're crazy if you think 60 Devil's going to come in here and make it, Jones. They are here. Now, be cool. Don't get yourself booted out just because you got a thing against whites. Look, they don't want us in their schools. We don't want them in ours. How's it going? Oh, hey. Fine, as long as we uh, stay on the reservation. I'm hip. Look, it's not going to be easy. Some of the teachers can help, but I'm afraid you're going to have to handle most of it yourself. Yeah, but it's hard. Sure. Just because you're outnumbered, I don't want you to start feeling that all the black kids are down on you. That's the way I found it so far, Mr. Davis. Good. Now, there's always somebody who wants to play hard, so you got to be with it. Oh. Well, for instance, if you go to the washroom, it's always a good idea to go in pairs. Going alone is the easiest way to get shaken down for lunch money. I go to the toilet only at home. Now, uh, remember, if you ever have trouble, stand up to it right away, OK? If you don't need me, give me a blast, huh? Hey. Any volunteers for the job? Live it up. You Mr. Davis? Yes. Yeah, well, I'm Roger Perkins' father. Roger? No, no, look, look, I don't want to make any long speeches. I want to get my boy out of this place. Roger? Let's go. We're going home. Well, Come on. I don't Come understand. On. He's doing fine. Doing fine? Things are running wild down here with you people. What people, Mr. I Davis? I think you know what I mean. Come on. Come oh, on. I'm doing OK. Shut up! Now, listen. I pulled some strings with a councilman I know. It's so all taken care of, Mr. Davis. Mr. Perkins, there are problems here, sure, just as there are out there. Oh, yeah, and whose fault is it? All these problems, Good Mr. Davis. Good question. Well, you worry about it. No. You better worry about it. Mr. Davis, sir. It's your, uh, oh, hold on. Oh, uh, sir? You got a minute? Sure, sure. Oh, well, my old school, you know, I played uh, basketball. Yes? Well, with the trial's coming up next week. I, uh, thought I might go off to the team. Well, uh, I don't know, Doug. It's a chance. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Now, remember what's happening. I don't know, man. I don't dig this scene. We're supposed to be playing ball. 
Man, when I was a Negro, I had white friends, but I'm black now. I ain't got none. So don't Uncle Tom me, you hear? Cool? Okay, squads three and four. you have Mr. Stewart's class right now? Yeah, but I had to study for a test, Mr. Davis. Oh, come on, man. You ain't studying nothing but the foxes. Mr. Stewart, he... Well, there's the bell. Johnson, you come along with me. I can't. I gotta go to work. Uh, come I... along, Johnson. You got time to study the foxes? You got time for me? But I gotta... It'll only take a minute. Come on. But I gotta go. Come on. 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 Come on, Amy, let's go. Why don't you sister stop woofing on people? Why don't you just cool it? Cool it? You're always talking about being black. Soon as one of you niggas see a little white stuff, you go up and smoke. All that black is beautiful turns to bullshit. Come on, she's crazy. Yeah, go ahead, run on! Take your little Miss Claire all with you. You know, any kid can keep a class laughing the way you do. Must be pretty sharp. Have uh, good tools. Well, that's true. I got a pretty good tool. Well, how come you can't read? You know, I don't know. Come on, man, you do. I don't remember. Well, you better call your boss, because we're going to be here for a while. Sit down. I never got around to it, OK? How come? I don't care. Well, I can't. Now, you're going to read. Oh, man, what for? You know as well as me, long as I shows up here, you got to promote me. That's the way it is down here. 
I don't give a damn how it is down here. You're gonna learn to read. What? This is a baby book. I know, I know. But we're gonna start here and work our way up, Leroy. I tell you what, take it home with you and start reading tonight. I thought it was one. I don't want any arguments about it. Why not to read this? Don't ask any questions, just do what I tell you, okay? Goes your ball game. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hold a second, will you? Where'd you get that? In a trash can. Hey, let me call you back, huh? Yeah. I gave it to Johnson so he could learn how to read. If the other kids saw him with it, he'd never live it down. The three little pigs just doesn't work here. And what does work? Welcome to the club. How do I get him started? Huh? He's been going to school for 11 years and he can't read. I mean, you can just see how bright that kid is. And that's what hurts. It's places like Disneyland. One teacher walks around eating carrots. He doesn't care, so why the hell should the kids? Monahan, she thinks she's some kind of missionary down here. Sets no standards, because she's just so sure us niggas can't learn nothing anyway. And Wilkerson, he'd like to put bars on all the windows. Christ, there must be a way. Maybe. But when you've banged your head against the wall as long as I have, you'll feel the way I do. And I'm going to be retired before I'm 30. A three, a four, I'm going to make that score. A five, a six. But couldn't you have picked a captain? No, they wanted you. Now, come on. A ten, tell me who's going to win. Now, what is it? All right, girls. Hi, Dolores. Hi, Angie. Good afternoon. How are you today? Fine. All right, girls, let's go. But can you dig it, OK? OK. Oh. He's gorgeous. Be quiet. He might hear you. I can't help it if I dig, older man. All right, girls, do your thing. Do you mind if I breathe? You're a smart dude, ain't you, man? 